Hello and welcome to another episode of Metal Detecting with Lugnut. This episode is going back out, trying out the back, seeing how things work, doing a couple little short hunts. Didn't want to overdo. And during the second hunt, I met somebody, which hopefully will lead to a third hunt at a house built in 1888. So it all it worked out pretty cool. Enjoy. Well, I stopped and hunted a place I've had permission for for a long time, but never really messed with because the house isn't that old. And this is kind of why you can see. Um, there's 95 cents worth of clad and an Xbox 360 Mountain Mountain Dew token or some kind of medallion. That's odd. Never seen that before. Let's go try another location. Had a signal here, 83, 82, all the way around. Flipped it out, and there it falls. You can see. Uh, now, there's a Cub Scout troop that meets here. And that's a Weeblow's neckerchief slide right here. Right here, so. I'll clean that up and show it to you. There you go, one Weeblow's neckerchief slide. I actually would have been surprised if I had hunted here and not found something like that. Uh, kids can't keep a hold of those things at all. Alright, next target. So at the second location we got two nickels, two dimes, a copper 1981 memorial, a Zinken rusty old square nail, which is indicative of the age of this church, and the Weeblow's neckerchief slide. I'm not going to go to another location. Uh, the ground's really too dry to be digging. Because the other place I was going is a friend of mine's yard. and I don't want to mess it up. But uh, it's been a good opportunity to get back in the saddle. Back's feeling okay. I don't want to overdo it. So thanks for watching.